All right. Hey, everyone. Thank you so much for tuning back in to another DOY Creations video. I am Jeanette, aka Soraya. And before I get started, I always like to give glory, honor, and praise to the Most High Yah. Y'all, just judging by the clock, it looks like I am a couple of minutes early. So I will wait for you guys, get your notification, and come on in. Actually, I intended to uh, do a post on Facebook and let you guys know that I was live. Hey, Jess. Hey, sis. Blessings to you. How are you today? I was intended on going on Facebook and probably Insta, but usually Facebook and let you guys know when I'm going live. But whatever, I'm here listening at work. Thank you so much. Please give me a thumbs up. Hey, Tanya, good afternoon. Thank you, ladies, for popping in with me today. I appreciate it so, so much. Hey, Sharon. Sharon, say good day, everyone. Sharon, how are you today? Listen, guys, I came on just a couple of minutes early. Y'all know how it goes when you're trying to get these lives in. You got to get in where you fit in, right? I am getting ready. Let me put my glasses on. Let's quit playing. Stop playing. Okay, stop playing. Um, I hope everyone is doing well.
All right, guys, thank you so much for being patient. I was just leaving you guys a message. Thank you guys so much for being patient. I had to uh, reboot my internet, so I think I'm okay. But thank you guys so much. I can't thank you guys enough for um, being patient with me in this internet. I mean, I can't, the internet that I have is high speed internet. And basically, I can't go any higher than what I already have. But regardless, be more Lisa, Lisa from um, Original Afrocentric Designs and everyone else that just came in. You guys are so awesome to um, hang in there with me. All right, guys. So let me show you what I'm working on today. I just grabbed some yarn. This is a super savior in the color mulberry mix and so i'm getting ready thank you iffy how are you thank you ladies uh, i'm getting ready to make a ski mask i'm starting on some project ladies that i, I share with you guys that i was going to be starting on with i was like you know what i want to um make some projects that i have never made before i'm basically just you know just learning new stitches learning new patterns it's nothing new about what i'm doing but it's new to me so i'm getting ready to be following um bag all day i was going to follow her tutorial and i probably do an overview but i'm sure the way that you start the hat is just a basic beanie four five six so i'm gonna do the portion to the basic beanie part and I might go to her video or I might just wing it on my own. I mean, how hard can it be? Mindful Crafts and more, Katrina, how are you today? She said, hi, Jeanette, and all on the chat. Thank you. Okay, got my what? Oh, thank you, Lisa. You are so awesome. How are you today? So, yeah, ladies, I um, got this project and I'm really behind the scenes guys i am cranking out some things that i have never done before I'm, I'm doing things i'm gonna come back and share with you guys but right now i am working on some things that i have never worked on before and i'm excited guys i am excited to be learning some new things you can always learn even from a craft that you've been doing Maybe like forever, you can still learn some new stitches, okay? New patterns and all that good stuff. So what is on you guys? Crochet hook or sewing machine or knitting needles? And what is in you guys' cup? What y'all got? What y'all got? What you have? Hi, Sandy, my beautiful friend, Sandy, from Left This Right Crochet. She said, hi, my idol, Jeanette, hugs. Hugs, honey, to you. Thank you so much, Sandy, for the hugs. I need them and I love them. Uh, Man, Mimi, Laura, oh my goodness, how are you? I'm so glad to see you. She said, hi, Jeanette, I finally got to catch you live. It's been a long time since I seen you. You look great. Thank you so much, Laura. That's from Mad Mimi, uh, Crochet and Farming. Um, original Afrocentric Designs by Lisa say, I am good. It's fall outside. It's fall outside. I'm happy. Uh, Jess Handmaid say happy crocheting. Yes. Uh, Mindful Craft said, Jeanette, we have seen you create. Uh, so I am confident you get. Yes. And you know what? And Sandy say hi, all my yarny friends. And hey, Laura. Tanya said, crocheting a baby blanket and drinking a zero Sprite. I am too. Hi, Manda. Good afternoon. Good to see you, Manda. Um, Manda, say good afternoon, everyone. And everyone is speaking. Uh, Jess said water, and I can't wait to work on my granny squares. Awesome. Yes, guys. It is. It, it's. You know what? The weather is so beautiful here in Chicago. When I tell you we got some beautiful weather, and the fall is in the air, guys. I think we got like 78, 79-ish degrees today. And I think I just gravitate to those temperature more only because I'm going through 
my hot flashes. And so I need the co cooler weather just to keep me cool and calm. But 79, 80, 82, I'm telling you, that's some beautiful weather. So we are experiencing kind of fallish weathers, guys, especially with the later on the evening. When it gets late, it drops down to the 60s. So this is a perfect time for me to start making my hats, guys. And so I'm getting ready to make a, 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 a ski mask. I think I'm going to wing it, or I probably do reference to Crystal from Bag Old Day. But I think I got the general concept. Uh, but thank you guys for believing in me. Hey, Tina Bailey, how are you? Yes. Laura, I am so glad to see you and everyone. Hey, Carol. She said, hey, everyone. Carol, how are you today? Sandy from left this right said, it's 64 degrees here this morning and 80 degrees now. Perfection. Yet, Sandy, I'm telling you, with this heat, this natural heat thing that I got, got going on, and I really can't wait for it to leave. I think people say you go through the menopause for 10 years or something like that, but I am so ready for these this heat wave inside of me to leave. But you got to take the good with the bad, right? Uh, Laura from Mad Mimi said, it's 47 degrees here in Alaska. Perfect for your hot flash. Perfect. It is perfect for my hot flashes. Carol said, I'm back addicted to making your uh, tan pattern. Oh, man, Carol. Make them, enjoy them. I, you know, that's why we put these patterns out here for everyone. We put them out here for everybody to use them, right? We take so much time of doing the tutorial. So I appreciate that, Carol, when anybody is using any of my patterns, my tutorials. I really appreciate that. It lets uh, you two know that, you know, maybe that was a good pattern that I made or something. But guys, I'm telling you, the weather, when it drops down to the 60. You, you know, I like to, I can go on my back, my back deck and my body be like, Woosa, good, thank you. Um, girl, menopause, yes, girl. It is no joke for nobody. And you know what, uh, Lisa from Be More, I used to be embarrassed to talk about it. I used to be sweating on camera and hoping that nobody noticed that I was sweating, right? So I was, I found myself drinking a lot of water. And then I, one day I was like, you know what? I just got to be honest with everybody. I am going through the changes and whether you recognize it, you guys probably was looking at me like she got a really beautiful glow. That was not a glow. That was sweat. <laughs> that was sweat on my face. It looked like I had a glow about myself. Original African Design says, I am trying to back up all my photos and videos and free up space on my phone, laptop, and tablet. I am drinking water. I need to add sugar and flavor to you. Add sugar to water? Well, whatever floats your boat. <laughs> Monda say, I'll send me, uh, you'll send me some of that cool air. Yes, it is. <laughs> I am enjoying it. You know, I'm just enjoying it, guys. I'll, I'll be remiss not to share that with you. Mindful Crafts and more. Katrina say, are you making opening for the eyes separate or do you uh, want opening for the mouth? Those are the only decisions to make for skipping. I am going to do the opening for the eyes. And because I know how to make windows, I figure how hard it can be, right? How hard can it be? So I'm going to go ahead and wing it while I got you guys on camera with me. Yes. Uh, so yeah, uh, Katrina from Mindful Crafts. Mine's just going to be the opening for the um, the eyes portion because we still got to wear the mask. So I'd rather just have my mask right under it. Uh, Mad Mimi said, I'm sorry you are having a hard time with my... I'm not. I love it. Five years and it's the best thing. You know what? I'm not having a hard time with it. I just was embarrassed to share it. I was, I was just embarrassed to share it. You know, I didn't, I didn't know. <laughs> Do you share anything like that? And once I got over that fear of sharing it, and then I realized it was a lot of other folks experiencing the same thing. 
it made mine even better. I had all day hot flash. And see, um, mine is not an all day, neither is it an all night. I just have those moments. It kind of like creep up on me, come unexpected, just be like, here I am. And my body be like, ah! So I have to keep water, H2O, H2O, where well, we, we all should be drinking water regardless, but I have to keep it on deck just in case. So I'm good. I'm glad about it. It's okay. It's part of being a woman. But I realized, I heard, I hear, I don't know how true it is, but I think men suffer from menopause too. I don't, you know, know if it's true or not, but I have heard people say that men have menopausal too. I don't know how true that is. Um, Monda say, I have really bad hot flashes when I was in my 20s. And now that I am off her modes, I'll be screaming. Oh my goodness. Hi, Vera. How Vera said hello all. Carol said, thanks for sharing your experience. I had a partial hysterectomy. I was told I'll probably experience it before 50. Yeah. And Lisa from B More said, my husband has high flashes. So it's not just a myth, right? One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's not a myth. Nine. I don't know what brings it on for them, but hey, whatever. You know, we all got changes. You know, we get older and we we all experience some type of changes, but we gotta go with the changes and embrace them and look good while we're going through them. That's what I say. I may be going through the menopause and whatever else I may experience, but I like to look good and feel good to the best of my abilities, right? I mean, don't be just, don't look the part, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. You don't have to look the part. I don't want nobody to look at me and be like, oh, girl, you are just going through the changes. It's written all over your face. <laughs> Unless you just see that sweat coming out of me. Uh, guys, what do you guys have in your cup? And is anybody working on anything right now? What are you guys working on? Oh, this yarn is kind of, it's kind of uh, splitting on me. This yarn is kind of splitting. The first yarn I pulled out my stash, guys, was the, um, I had got some camo yarn, but it's in the, uh, is it Patreon or Patreon yarn? And it was wool. And I was like, there's no way <laughs> on the most high green earth that I could ever wear wool on my face. And so I had to go back into my stash and pull out this um this red heart yarn and mulberry. Laura said, I'm drinking chocolate milk and working on a back scrubby. Awesome. Sharon, did I speak? Let me speak again. You say I have water and I am working on an AKA jacket for the first time. Awesome. Um, everyone is speaking. Vera say start making blankets for grandkids. Christmas present. Okay. Be more. Lisa say I have Coca Cola in my cup and a and a hat on my. Awesome. That is so awesome. Uh, let me just drop this, turn this off. That is so awesome. So yeah, guys, um, Carol said, since you're talking to us, I started a ski mask, lay my tam to the side, peer pressure, no pressure here. Okay. No pressure, Carol. Move at your, your own pace. Mom to say men do suffer from it. My husband has been going through going through them for years he's older so maybe that's what it is and he has the mood swings as well <laughs> you know what i was sharing that with someone before that you know they make it you know society is something else but it would appear like only women's have mood swings no men's have mood swings as well why do they put all that pressure on females as though men are made of steel. They're not, they're human beings. They go through emotions just like all the rest of us, right? 
Hi, Dorian. Dorian said, hello, everyone. He said, they certainly do, Mondo. <laughs> yes, men's can experience. Uh, Mindful Crowd said, yes, men's can experience high flashes. The difference is they have declined and it's an andro, octro, I'm going to mess that word up. And we have declined in estrogen. The symptoms are the same though. Yes. You know, it's just, you know, it's something we all experience different things, right? But I say embrace it. I embrace it because, you know, it's part of, it's part of getting older, right? Even though, like someone said earlier, uh, Manda, I believe it was, uh, who, who suffered a little bit early on, I say if you're here to live through it, embrace it. Now, when I get hot, I do have to grab me some water and sit down somewhere and get under the fan and get to myself so that thing pass away. But it's not so, you know, it doesn't. It doesn't affect me the way it used to. I, I because I embraced it. You said I'm working on a receiving blanket and drinking water. Yes, Manda, I have my what my water right here. Let me bring it over to this table so you guys can see it and get inspired to drink some yourself. I'm telling you guys, regardless if you. The thing about it is, regardless if you like water or don't like water, the, the fact of the matter is our body is made up with a high percentage of water. So we definitely need to, you know, keep ourselves hydrated. It doesn't matter what season it is. I want to thank you guys so much for hanging in there. Sorry about earlier. I had to reboot. I had to reboot the... Um, the box over there and I was off for a few minutes. So thank you for staying here. And I just ran upstairs and grabbed my phone and said, let me talk to you guys via my phone. Uh, hi, Karen. How are you? So glad to see you. Hi, Angela. She said, good afternoon, Janet and everyone. Angela, how are you today? I'm so glad to see everyone. I am so glad to see everyone. Y'all, let me tell you something. Some people can do lies. They just turn on their computers and they just, boom, they lie. It is so much preparation for me. It is a preparation thing for me, okay? Because if y'all saw how I was running through this house earlier, you know, because um, before I go live, I try to make sure that by time my husband gets home, by time my son gets home, you know, they have their little dinner ready for them. And I don't want to get out of my life and didn't have to run upstairs and cook and, you know, get all that prepared. So I like, as soon as they get in, they, they food is ready for them. It just makes my life a whole lot easier. So trying to cook and I said, okay, everything is ready for them because with my son, he will eat pizza all day, every day. If I had if he had, if my son had his way, in case you guys don't know, I have a 12 year old son. And if he had his way, he would eat pizza or eat noodles all day, every day. I mean, he, he just don't get tired of it. I'd be like, no, you know, as a parent, I can't have you eating pizza and noodles. I buy it just for emergencies, not for an everyday meal, but he loved pizza. He loved to come home and I don't have dinner ready yet. And he'd be like, can I put on a pizza? Can I put on a pizza? He loved that job. When I was uh, when I was younger, I really thought that I could eat pizza every day. Boy, when you get older, I'm like, no, I do not want that sauce in the meat every day. That cheese, man, you just it just don't agree with you. Yeah. But anyway, guys, I am. Um, like I said, the weather is so cooperative right now. I should have did this. If my internet was good, I would have did this outside, y'all, on my deck. Y'all, let me share something with you all. Thank you. Please thumbs up, y'all. It helps out so much. So if you're not following me on DOY Life, that is my second channel. Y'all, I had grown some bell peppers. I have never grown bell peppers before. 
and I bought a bell pepper plant. And last night when I was cooking dinner, I cooked the bell peppers that I had from my garden. Y'all, I'm just so humble. I, I'm, I'm just, I, man, I can't even express. And my son told me last night when we was eating dinner, he said, Ma, he said, did, did you use those peppers you got from, you know, from your plant? And I said, yeah. He said, they're delicious. And you know, I was charged up. I was just, I was feeling myself. I'm like, am I a gardener? I don't know. <laughs> I think I got to grow more than just bell peppers to be called a gardener, but uh, I'm just excited. Uh, Laura from Mad Mimi said, my son is 16 and he could eat pizza all the time too. I mean, when we was that age, I used to be able to get it in like that. But when I got older, I'm like, it's just, it just, it, I like it, but whoo, it make me pay. It make me pay like that commercial, like that Tom's commercial. It makes me pay. A lot of food makes me pay. But yeah, so I, um, you know, so anyway, I start tending to, you know, I grab those peppers and I brought them in. I cleaned them up last night and I cook it, you know, with my dinner last night. So that had just expired me to be like paying attention more to my bell peppers. And I think I'm getting ready to grow some, um, some green onions. So I got my bell peppers and onions. I like to grow green onions only because you can grow those indoors. And that's one of the things I like about growing green onions. I grow those right indoors and they grow like wild flowers. And I don't have to worry about all this chemical. Veggie grown in your own garden always tastes better. They have love in them. Yes, Laura, I 100% agree. And it came through with my dinner last night. I was smiling as I was cutting up bell pepper. I was like, you know, that is awesome, Jeanette. So happy for you. Yes, you have to try something something new next time you're playing. Yes, I like I said, I have grown in the past green onions. So I'm just gonna get some onions, cut the, the uh, bottom part out. And all you do is put those in dirt and water and they grow like wildflowers. I'm like, that is so amazing. Monda say, uh, that's, that's my boy for you. Mine used to eat us out of a house and home. Girl, my son is a, he's petite, he's a, I mean, he's 12. He's he's the size how he's supposed to be. But girl, I can't buy enough pizza. My husband, like, he always tell me, get extra because you know how he's going to do, right? Um, Angela said, I am so proud of you, Jeanette. And it makes a difference when you harvest it yourself. It does. Hi, Linda from Quilty Crochet. She said, hello, my beautiful Jeanette. How are you today, Linda? It's, it's a, a, a humbling experience when you grow something like I used to always admire when I saw people in a garden and growing things. And then I watch a lot of YouTube videos and how they, you know, teaches us, you know, a lot of you guys teach how to grow certain things, herbs and things in your home. And I was like, I was always fascinated about that. And then I was like, one day I had uh, just grab some onions, cut the onions and start growing them. And it's just a humbling experience. So I don't know. I think I'm on my way to gardening ship. <laughs> ah, yes. Garden grown veggie. Uh, Monda say garden grown veggies are the best to me. And they are. Hey, Tina from Craft by D Rose. How are you? Hey, Marsha Lee from Blast Stitches Creation. She said, I'm glad I caught you. Had a doctor's appointment. How was everything, Marsha Lee? Yes. You know why? Because you know, we don't, I think when you grow them yourself, we don't have to worry about putting it in stores. So our harvest is only for ourselves. But when you got to, you know, do a uh, 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 garden for the world, you know, they got to put a lot of stuff to help it grow quicker and faster and all that stuff. But when you garden for yourself, you don't have to worry about that. It's just for you. So I am so happy. Tina, how was your dog coming along? Girl, you've been working overtime with it. You've been working overtime. Craft Baddy Rose said, hello, Jeanette. I gave you a thumbs up already. And I watched all the ass. Tina, bless you for watching the ass. I appreciate that. Everybody is speaking. Lisa from Be More said, uh, garden grown tastes 
fresh and smell amazing. It really, really does. And I was just like, and it's a humbling type of experience as well. Uh, Laura from Mad Mimi said, we grew all kind of stuff this season. I ended up with 88 cups of shredded zucchini and it's in the freezer for this winter. Zucchini bread, zucchini lasagna, sketty, uh, uh, is it called sketty sauce? Here we come. Yes, that is so awesome. It can uh, Tina said it can it came out. Oh, uh, let you uh Tina, if you come up, will you be able to stay up? Because I don't want uh you to come up and then leave, and then it's not gonna, it's not gonna work. I've been very hesitant to bring anyone up because I don't want anybody to come up and then they go off, and then I Y'all already know my internet. I was already bad this morning. Blancy said everything was great. Trying a new medication, uh, True List City. So I had to go follow up today. Oh, awesome. I hope everything works out for you. Okay, Tina. Uh, let me just do this. And anybody else who wants to come up, but if you come up, please stay up. <laughs> <laughs> because if you come up and you come off, that's going to be the end of my chat <laughs> because uh, I already messed up earlier. Um, it already messed up earlier because I had to, you know, reboot. But here you go, Tina. Tina said, yes, yeah, she's going to stay up here with me. And if anybody else wants to come up and show what they're working on, what you got going on or want to share anything, please come up. But please stay up. <laughs> but anyway, guys, so yeah, it was just a humbling experience. And the thing about it is I buy the plant food and water. That's it. That's all. So I got my plant food. I got my water. And I let the most high do the rest. You know, and it was just a beautiful experience. Uh, let's see. Oh, my goodness. It blinked. Hold up. There is Miss Tina. Let's welcome Tina in the house. Hi, Tina. I'm crazy. Hey, how you doing? I'm okay. doing good. I'm closing it up. See okay. It? It's closing up. And uh, the hands is going to be the last thing I do. But she got her feet on. She got everything. And Now, when I get through closing it up up here, then I'm going to put the nose on because the nose is the same color as the face, but the lips and the eyes are different. Okay. So the nose will go on when I get through with the closing the head up. Oh, sugar now. Yeah. Tina, that has been a labor of love. Yes. Tina, that, that is a labor of love because you are doing all single crochets, right? Mm -hmm. single yeah. crochet, me and single crochets unless I'm doing some type of grafting which I don't do too much of that that is the only how I can do single crochet I do not prefer single crochet it's 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 a long process but it's going to be nice once you are done with it yeah and, and you gonna, mm -hmm. when I when I get through with everything like I have to um Take and shake everything with the needle and thread. Ooh, Charlie. And make sure everything is like uh make sure that they cannot take and tear any pieces off that I put on. Oh, so you was working at two on oh, two of them at a time? Yeah, I got because I got three babies that I got to give some. B. Moore said, uh, that's Lisa. She says single crochet is evil. <laughs> no, I love it. No, I single crochet is not my it's I I mean I like the results from single crochet, mm. but actually working a project with single crochet is time consuming. But you're doing mm. a great job. So you gotta you got two almost done. Mm. And what else? What else? I gotta make uh Cause one of my granddaughters, she's selfish, y'all. I already know she's selfish. Okay. How old is she? That's the oldest one I got. Okay. But 
She okay. will not let these, she won't ha play, let the babies have these. Well, you made it for her. Hey, Charlie. I'm Charlie. making it for the babies. And I told her, I said, that's why I say you selfish. Oh, she wanted for herself. No, she don't want to let them have it. She she won't let them have the dolls. Wait a minute, Tina. Charlie said, hello, everyone. Charlie, how are you? I'm so glad to see you. Your dolls look amazing. Uh, Lisa said, hi, Angela. Je Angela said, hi, creation. Everyone in the chat, Tina Ray. How are you doing today? I'm doing fine today. Still Thank working you. on a knitted stitch, knitting stitch markers holder, drinking water. Awesome, Angela. She's came from you. Gone ahead, I'll have to feed all my animals. Was great. Laura, it was so good to see you from Mad Mimi. Take Thank care. You. Let's stay in contact. Angela Young say, I love single crochets more than Thank trouble crochet. Yeah. yeah, now Tina, I don't know why. Well, what's what she don't want them to have it? Mm -mm. Why not? Do you know why? Yeah, she told me she said she afraid of them, and she won't buy them no Barbie dolls. And she got two girls, but she won't let them have dolls. Okay, she afraid of the eyes on them. Well, so. Yeah. If that's, well, Tina, if that's what she's at with it, I mean, you got to respect. I know. I'm going to make, make some. She told me to make um, uh, amigurumi, the uh, uh, the animal-like thing. She don't want it to be a doll, though. Okay. Mm. Well, you know what? Some people are um, not doll people. They not clown people. They not right. animal people. So we got all kind of peoples, but you know, right. you gotta you gotta get in. You gotta give people what they want and respect their, you know, wishes. I know, and that's why I got that. But see, my other granddaughter. So this was her, the one that don't want to die. This was her baby's die. Okay. But since. I'm gonna get this doll to the other baby that I haven't finished. <laughs> <laughs> I just gonna say, I know you got enough grandchildren. Got 17. I got seventeen. Honey, I know you can get it moving, moving around. Oh, yeah. Uh huh. That's what I'm gonna do. And so the one that's gonna end up getting this, she love everything. Okay. It don't matter what it is. She love it all. Anything I give her, she be like. <laughs> give it probably up. say beautiful work, <laughs> Tina. She said your work is beautiful. Thank you. So y'all gonna get to see me make something else. So as soon as I get through making this, I'll make, I'm gonna make, uh, I gotta find the book, but I'll find the book this weekend. Okay. Uh, let me show y'all what it's gonna be. This here is one of them. Uh, only thing is with this, I was testing it to uh, see if I knew how to do it. Uh-huh. And it's one of those uh, unicorn things. Oh. Remember the unicorn thing that I sent y'all? Yeah. The for? Yes. I'm going to make it. I oh. got to make it. Yeah. Wow, Tina. And you know who else was making unicorns? Your other friend. Angela said, I have family members that are afraid of all uh, types of dolls when I use to make them. I mean, it's not for everybody. It's just not, you know, and I don't, you know, I don't like, go ahead. Come up here. I don't like to uh, force the hand when someone tells me that they don't like something. I, I prefer leaving it alone. It could be, you know, things that happen to them early on personally. I don't know. Whatever the reasons are, you know what I'm saying? Whatever the reasons are, don't give it to them. Even though you're like, oh, it's so cute and they gonna love it. I try to honor the parents with wishes. I try to honor it. I mean, I have small grandchildren, you guys, and my my daughter will say something and hey, and she don't want them to have certain things, I don't give it to them. I don't go, I don't go behind her back and give it to them or anything like that because I don't know the really effects that they're going to have. OMG.
G, is that my beautiful friend Ursula uh, from OM Granny Square? Ursula, how are you today? She says, so glad to catch this live screen. I am so glad you caught it as well. And I had to, um, basically, Ursula, I had to reboot right in the midst, right in the midst of my conversation. My, my internet said, you know what? You got to reboot me. And there's no one using internet right now but me. But you know what? That's the nature of, you know, being a YouTuber. <laughs> being a YouTuber, it doesn't matter. I pay for happy internet. However, there's nothing high but the costs. Ursula, are you working on anything? Well, you, it's nighttime for you. Thank you so much for popping in with me for a few minutes. I'm telling you, about five minutes, I was just, the screen was all black because of my my internet had vacate had went on vacation. It just it just left. It went on vacation. I said, "Are you coming back or what? What's what's going on right now?" Again, guys, I'm working. Oh, I think I put it in the title, right? I'm working on my ski mask, and I'm excited about it. I'm thinking I want to wing it myself. If it comes out kind of wonky, then. I I would go and look at crystals from Bag Old Day. If not, I, I think I got, I think I got the gist of. I mean, how hard can it be? How hard can it be? However, I am making things, guys, behind the behind the scenes that I'm working on my bucket list, guys. I share with you guys that I was making a bucket list and I'm adding things to the bucket list, and I am uh, making some of those projects that. I added, so stay tuned so you guys don't miss out on any. You say I was on my way to bed and saw you were live, so I'm glad I met. Oh, thank you so much, Ursula. Thank you so much. Even if you just have me running, sometimes I have to do that as well. I'd be like, I'm here when you're on, but I'm not in front of you. So don't ask too many questions because I just have you playing. That's it. <laughs> I'm busy with my third mosaic blanket. So glad to be making progress. That is so awesome. That is so awesome. awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Tina. So, yeah, I was telling them, Tina, um, that I got a bucket list and I'm making things that I said I was going, I've always wanted to make, never got around to making it. So I figure if you just start making what you, Anticipate on making, get it, get it done. Just get it done. Get her done. I'm getting yeah. it done, guys. Yeah. I'm getting. Yeah, it done. I get yes. it. I get it. I get it. I get it. Cause uh, I got a bucket list of stuff too. We need to make the bucket list video again. Cause my bucket list and changed. Yeah. You know, because life changes, life goes on, and you know, you 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 do all so much. Life it changes from day to day. It does. It really it does. Day to day. It and really you know, does. And then, like with me, when things change, like when you know, I'm supposed to get my she shed. Oh, I, no, I didn't know. Are you? Yes, yeah, coming. Okay. It's coming, okay. girl. Okay. And I was surprised when uh, I didn't realize, you know, I wanted it, but, you know, didn't realize that it was that time yet. And I was like, oh, my God. First, I was panicking over it. Now I'm happy and can't wait to see it come. Hey, uh, uh, um. What's called uh um, oh Lord Ursula Ursula yeah she said I'm making a list of things that I haven't done in crochet so new things to learn new things is always to learn Sam said wow everyone here is a mod I don't think everyone thank no. you so much Ursula she said love you my life is richer with you in it oh wow what a kind thing to say Ursula 
and you know that you're super you're super you're super 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 thank you so much ursula thank you thank you thank you yeah guys so i just want to um you know just get some things done that i it's really been on my my mind and sometimes um you gotta have the right sam say hello all hello to you Sam. um Sometimes you got to, you know, stop fearing the unknown. So a lot of times, and then you also got to get the right person to show you how to do certain, certain stitches. So like I was trying to, I was on YouTube this morning at work. Yes, I was on YouTube at work and I was uh, looking at different people, how they do certain things. And it could be the same pattern, but everybody just says it a little different differently and i was like i didn't understand that person so i went over that one i went to the next person i went to three tutorials before i got the concept of what i was trying to do mm -hmm. yeah that could happen yeah so that could happen and everyone mm -hmm. always say you know <clears throat> easy it doesn't always be easy it's not always easy or they'll say you know uh <clears throat> excuse me <clears throat> they'll say uh beginners and it might be beginners but i i didn't catch on to it and i i love it when you got multiple choices that you can make you know what i'm saying guys you got multiple people that's doing it and you're gonna find somebody that you will get the hang of it yeah you will find someone that you get the hang of it because when i get frustrated too long i look at it long enough and i'll figure that thing out myself i'll be like you know what i got it i'll figure it out myself i'll be like i no, i got it let me just let me see how yeah. i can do it so yeah. yeah so yeah tina i'm glad that you're going to be able to just move those dolls around to the next person that's that's fine keep it moving oh, girl keep it moving i got a bunch of kids so i can always do that <laughs> ursula I, I said do. yesterday was so frustrating learning something new got so uh got so little done so frustrating discouraging today also derailed it so looking forward to getting something done tomorrow sometimes ursula you gotta put that project down and walk away and sometimes oh, okay. by walking away and coming back to it um <clears throat> katrina say water jeanette <laughs> you are so right katrina because i got all choked up uh hi jardine jardine said hi ladies good morning good morning hello 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 uh hi lisa from lily crochet and more she's hey jeanette hey everyone in the chat she said hey tina hello 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 <laughs> um, how y'all all doing I love yeah. you guys. i'm closing her up now see i think when you live you get more done don't you huh when you doing live videos you do you get more done don't you yeah try to if they well they was leaving as i uh they was leaving as I was, it was getting time for me to close. That's all right. I ain't worried about it. I'm glad they're gone. I told at first I was supposed to be going to the gym, but I'll just go tomorrow because I am a she bit sore. And I don't want, you know, I don't, I was just there yesterday. So I don't want to hurt myself. Yeah. I'm I'm being careful. I'm like, okay. Please be careful. Uh, Ursula said, yeah, I didn't park that project. I would have quit. So glad I parked it in time. <laughs> you parked it, Ursula, before you had an accident, huh? <laughs> Hi, Lydia. How are you? She said, good afternoon, everyone. What's everyone is making? Hello, Lydia. I'm taking a break from KB Afghan, Nitty Loom, I'm Crow. I'm crochet something new. I'm making fingerless gloves. I am doing it my own way. Yes. Let's see, Tina. Oh, wow. Girl, you got that tight. 
That's yeah. beautiful. That's so neat. That is yeah. so neat. Yeah. Wow. So now what I'm going to do is, let me show y'all what I'm going to do. Now I'm going to go see this back scene. See that scene? Mm -hmm. See that? Wait a minute. See that scene right here? Barely. Wait a minute. There it goes. See that scene right there? Yeah. I San see Andreas it. fault. I'm going to go down in San Andreas fault. Go around and go to the nose. Oh, um, yeah. Let's see. Michael Kraft said, I always watch multiple videos and read multiple books to learn. I am a Southpaw, so I I have to reverse what I see. I hear that. Hi, Consuelo. How are you? She said, Hi, everyone. She said, What Tina is making? Tina is making a doll, a doll, and I am making a ski mask. I am making the ski making mask. Let me see the ski mask that y'all made. Yeah, this all I got so far. Oh, okay. <laughs> I just started it right here. Uh, Consuelo said hi, everyone. Hello, Consuelo. How you I, doing? Actually, Tina, I just got started with it when I came on camera. Oh, okay. Yeah, when I came on camera. Sometimes that's what I do. Um, I start projects when I come on camera. And then I get so much of it done. And then I got the rest of the week to, you know, work it. Justin Hall said, love, Tina. Hi, Justin. Yes, hey, Justin. Okay, so see, now I went down and I'm finding that San Andreas fault. So what I'm doing, is, see, I came all the way. Oh, come on. Uh, you see, I came out of that hole. I'm going to go back in that hole and go down some more. And go around all the way around. And every time I come out, I'm going to go back in the hole until I get to where I want the nose to start at. Okay? Okay, girl. All right. I'm telling you. I, you know, that's what I want. I want people, to, you got to be able to follow what I'm telling you. Yeah, so, you, you probably, uh, Distinctive Crochet, Priscilla, my beautiful Priscilla, how are you? Uh she said, I had to help with school work. Yes, Priscilla. Yes. Um, yeah, Tina. You know what? I can't, I can't follow along like that, Tina. Um, I'm a visual and I'm a I got a person, I like I gotta pause and then start back, pause, then start back. If you just tell me, I don't always get it. And it can okay. be the edit simplicity. Yeah. And see, I what, I it. see what it was came mm -hmm. out right up up there, right there. Uh-huh. Right there. I went back in that same hole, and now it's come out right here. And mm -hmm. now I'm gonna go back in this hole right here. Where this see where it's at now? We'll go back in the hole and I'm gonna travel the needle around to where I need it to be at to get to the front. The front is over here, and the nose gotta go like right in there. Tina Jardine yeah. said, Tina, is there a pattern for that doll or a tutorial? It will be once I figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> she said it will be Jardine once she figure it out. Let I got to figure it out first. <laughs> uh, Tina, uh, Distinctive Crochet said, hey, Jeanette and everyone, I'm out of the ads now. How are you, Priscilla? I'm so glad hey, to see you. Yes. Hey, Amanda from Montgomery Yarn Shopping. How are you today? Uh, Lydia said Tina is easy to make all dolls. How did she start? Well, Tina said that she's, you know, once she figured, out, figured it all out, she probably give us either a written pattern or she probably do a tutorial. So we got to kind of be patient till she finish it. <laughs> but as you can see, Tina, a lot of folks is loving what you got so far. A journey say, okay, I will wait. Uh, on well, I have to figure it out first. I haven't figured it all out. And plus, I wrote some of it down, but I haven't figured it all out yet. And, yeah. I, and I'm because I had tried to work with um, a number counter thing, okay. but 
I seen how somebody else was doing it, and I think I'm. I, I think I've because you got to kind of like keep up with your numbers each each stitch. Right. Okay. So I fa- I seen which one they was using, and they offer it with a count. I think it's like four or five of them that where you can like like when you when you trying to count something you can like okay say that this uh, for this arm is got a number counter that's blue this one this one got a number counter that's yellow this one got a number counter that's red and then they got one that's black so i'm gonna try to get those number counts they in my amazon wish list okay i'm gonna try to get them i think i'll do because what it is is that you got to be able to count this stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And this, it, it is. Can y'all see? Yeah. I mean, that's a lot of counting to do. Yeah. So I applaud the people who to who do do all that counting to to make a pattern. But yeah. I'm, you know, and then like here well that's why i want the studio too because when i get to the studio i'm not gonna have to be bothered with none of the stuff that i be bothered with i can turn my phone off i can just concentrate on what i'm doing and i don't have to let nobody disturb me right when there when i'm there i'll be there doing what i need to be doing you know so it'll be it'll be e- i think it'll be easier for me. and then once i get like i'll be able to set up my equipment different than here i keep telling y'all the problem here is that i'm in one little tight corner i have a whole space that i can work with in and, your uh studio uh yeah. Jen- Jess from Handmade Design said, hey, Tina, and she dropped Tina link. If you guys are not Thank part you. of Craft Bad D. Row, oh, that's Priscilla dropped your link. If Thank you're you, not Priscilla. part of Priscilla, uh, Tina channel, please be calm. Still listening. Thank you, Jess. Hi, Kelly Crochet Adventures. How are you today? So glad to see you. Tina, yeah, you're absolutely right. When you got, um, when you, um, doing a pattern you cannot miss not one stitch because one one single crochet would throw that whole doll off off key right so that's why it's so important uh she said hey everybody in the chat that's why it's so important that you know if you don't if you don't if i didn't start off writing it down i can't go in the middle and start writing it Mm-mm. like i can't be oh yeah. i think i did this and i think i did that i can't do that because it's gonna throw you off it's gonna right. throw you off kelly say hey there everyone in the chat going to all these now uh so just saying hi thank you amanda uh anna johnson you said hi love from york england how are you and welcome anna this video from Jess Handmaids. Yeah. Yes. Thank you, Priscilla, for dropping her link. What'd you say, Tina? I'm just showing them how I go back in. Okay. Pull it in. See? Uh-huh. Uh, wait a minute. Where is that? See how I'm just pulling it and getting it to come around. Uh, and now I'm going to put it right back in that hole. Let me put it back in there. Girl, y'all pay attention because I ain't trying to make one no time soon. <laughs> okay, so I'm putting it back in that hole. The then I gotta come out. I gotta figure out where to come out at. Yeah. <laughs> y'all paying attention? <laughs> y'all got it because I don't. Okay. See. See oh. how. I'm going right back in the same hole. Ah, come on. I'm going right back in the same hole that I went in so that I can come out. Okay, and I'm going to come out close to where that nose going to be at. Tina, 
Miss Tina, uh, that looks like you're doing surgery. I am <laughs> doing surgery. <laughs> <laughs> That's what Ursula said. <laughs> Just had me say, uh, blessing lady, she'll be right back. She said, yeah. have so, now, so now the, 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 the thread is almost, I got to make sure where I'm going to put the nose at, but I'm not far from it because it's in the front now. Okay. Yeah. Now, the back and now it's in the front. See, the uh, back has got the line in it and the front ain't got no line. So that's how you know the back from the front. Okay. Uh, listen. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Oh. Anna say hi everyone. Thank you for your welcomes. Thank you for the thumbs up, Anna. And uh yeah, so glad to have you in the chat today. Thank you so much. Yes, Tina. Honey, I'm I'm gonna stick with this. I'm gonna stick with making this um this ski mask and be content, Tina. And I promise you, my ski mask is going to be made a lot faster than a doll. <laughs> Lydia said. But you know what, Janet? Almost every project that I pick up, I don't really pick up too many projects that are not super duper long projects to do. I don't really don't pick worry. up many. Everything I, I pick up is uh, like... <laughs> Uh, but I end up, I finish them though. I finish yeah, them a long finish. time. It might take me a long time, but I finish them. Lydia said, you're doing a good job, Tina. And the doll, that's a lot of work and time. Wow. Hey, Mama G. Mama G say hello, lovelies. Mama G, how are you? Angela say, that is the way to needle a uh, sculpture to crochet and Clo oh, make clothes dolls. Oh, okay. Uh, Ursula said, I've got a spine down my back. That's one way to tell which side is the front and the back. Yes. I, I guess you just got to know, you know, anytime you got that sangria thing going, mine's always tend to lean. I can never start it it's just like a straight line. Mine is always on a slant, you know. So you always know when I connect it because it got that kind of sort of slant to it. Uh, Lily said, Jeanette, the ski mask seems like it's complicated to me. Oh, uh, you know what? I am going to wing it myself. I'm not, only how I'm going to follow a pattern if I run into a problem, but I'm quite sure I shouldn't run into a problem. Uh, I'm just going to wing it myself. Uh, if I do need help, I will... Uh, I would go to Crystal Bag O'Day. I'll reference her tutorial. But um, yes, yeah, a nice slant. It's just always, it's never straight up and down. I always got that slant version. Um, Kelly said, Oh, thank you so much, Crochet Cousin Priscilla. Yes. Yeah, mine's also slant. It always, you always know what mine's begin. I'll be like, I really prefer it not to be shown where it begins but it always do um thank you priscilla for dropping ursula link thank you if you guys are not part of om granny square that's my beautiful friend ursula join her family lydia said i am always looking for easy things to make crochet fingerless gloves are easy to make yeah um i gotta ask you tutorial on that as well <laughs> on how to make fingerless gloves and fingerless glove is a one day type of project a few hours you could just sit to yourself because what i like about fingerless gloves you can use any stitch you know you're basically just you know fitting something around your uh hand so um yeah hi angela that's crafty crochet and bible with angela good afternoon all good afternoon angela yes guys so I am just trying to just do the things that I have set for on my bucket list and I am making it guys. I'm going to come back. I'm kind of like, you know how you start saying everything that you're getting ready to make. I'm going to make this and I'm going to make that. I'll make this and I'll make that. And you find out you're not making any of those things. So I decided to shut my mouth and just make the things. Just don't even announce it. Just make it. <laughs> just be like, bam, it's done. 
but I know a lot of you guys was going to ask me what I was making. So I decided to go ahead and put it in the title so you guys can uh, start on your project two, four. Yeah. So I'm starting off with a basic beaming. So yeah. Uh, you talking to Lisa. Hey there. You talking to Angela. Good day to everyone that's coming in. Please don't forget to thumbs up this beautiful host. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Priscilla. Hey, Vicky from Got Your Hook. She said, hello, Jeanette and Tina and everyone working and lurking. Isn't that the best <laughs> to be working and lurking? That shows. Oh, thank you, Priscilla. That's what you did. You forget that uh, I did a crochet along for the fingerless glove. I knew I had a tutorial on it, but I really forgot. Was it a crochet along? Thank you, Priscilla. So, yeah, guys. Uh, I'm going to make this, I'm going to whip this mask up real quick. I'm trying everything I said that I wanted to do. I want to do it and get done with it. It's going to be done and over with. Look at, look at, look at uh, Tina concentrating. She concentrating real good. <laughs> <laughs> Tina, you get some quiet. Hey, look at me. Hey, hey, hey Priscilla. <laughs> Hey, uh, gotcha. I mean, uh, gotcha. Oh, gotcha. gotcha hook. Yeah. That's big. Gotcha hook. Okay, because I can't see it. All. <laughs> you, know, you went down like you went focused, girl. You was focused. I know. Like, I'm not on a yarn band, but I'm working a hole in my stash to do a legit yarn haul. Awesome. <laughs> well, you know what? I think it's coming up to my band being complete because you guys know i went on a yarn band i was like i ain't gonna buy no more yarn but if the price is right <laughs> only if the price is right yes they like tina is focused on making that nose she ain't gonna have no crooked nose i ain't trying to that's for sure her grandbaby ain't gonna have no crooked nose <laughs> Uh -oh, oh, thank you, Priscilla. Thank you so much. I took the um, extensions out and I was like, and Priscilla, you look this so beautiful in your little uh, thing. I was like, okay, I don't want to, I don't want to wear the exact thing, Priscilla, but she has inspired me to pin my hair up and wear a band around it. So thank you so much, Priscilla. Yeah. I had uh, took the extensions down, and you know how that go, Tina. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a job. That's a job in itself. But yes, it wait. is. Yeah. Uh, so how many? How long you think you got to go, Tina? About another week or another couple of weeks? What you giving yourself? I'm, I'm short a couple of pieces that I need, y'all. I, I I don't have a couple of items that I need. Like for this one, I really need her some purple lace. Purple lace? Okay. Yeah, purple lace. She need purple lace. Let me show y'all what I'm talking about. Well, while you getting that, you're welcome, Priscilla. Lydia said, next project I am going to make is headbands. Yes. Priscilla headband looked so pretty on her. If you guys uh didn't see how she looked with her uh hair pent up i was like that is just so pretty i remember i used to i have a tutorial on that too oh ursula to my beautiful jeanette thank you ursula and you know that you're super again you're super again you're super 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 yes my friend. Mm -hmm. you are so awesome you are yes. so awesome ursula She's supposed to be in bed, guys, and she is up with me. Blessing me. I need me. lace like this, but I need it in purple. Okay. Where you get something like that from? Joanne. Okay. Okay. See, it's kind of, see how... Uh, it's lazy. How, yeah. It's beautiful. Yeah. It's beautiful. Is that going to be part of the doll garment? Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. wow! Yeah. Oh wow! That is going to be so. But I need it in purple for that for that one doll. So 
and then I got to uh, I gotta make sure that I have the right color thread. Yeah. For I I, I don't think I have the thread to shape this nose in. This one, you know. I don't think I had a right color yet. I mean, cause I can't, you can't, you can't, it's gotta be where you can't see where I did the work with the needle and thread. So uh -huh. I got to match it. So I'm going to have to match up the thread for this doll. And y'all know, y'all know Miss Tina is professional. All that stuff. Yeah. She, she's, she's very thorough with her details. She's into the details. I'd be like, is that string hanging? I cut it. And she'd be like, no, I need to make sure it's perfect. Girl, mine is imperfect. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, I got to try to do it. I, because, you know, I know that these things last. These things can last 100 years. I have things that I have things right now that I've had for 30, 40 years already. Okay. And they'll last another 30, 40, 50 years. So therefore, you know, when you got things that will last that long, you want it to be done at a certain way. Yeah, so I, I get it. I get it. Trust me, I get it. Uh Angela said, Tina, have you tried invisible quilting thread yet? Um, no, I usually just get the color that matches the what I'm working on. Okay. I usually just get get the color that I'm, you know, I, I'm just going to have to, it's all right, though. You know, I'm at the point, I don't let things, I, I do stress sometimes, occasionally, a little bit, <laughs> but I know that I got to go get the thread for this, you know. I know that I got to go get some purple lace, you know. It just make me have to go to the store to get it. That's all. Yeah, you wanted to get there anyway, but they are giving you some suggestion. Mindful Crafts and Moore said, if you can't find purple, Tina, get a pack of Ritz, Ritz dye and do a DIY project. Lace take up oh, colors man. easily. Oh. Oh no, nah. I I ain't dying. Uh 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 uh. I'm gonna find if I don't find purple, I'm gonna try to find pink. I'm gonna try to find, but they have it at Joanne's. They be having it. It's gonna be easy to find. Jardine, yeah. uh, Tina channel is called Craft by the Rose. They had dropped it earlier, but it's Tina. Can you can you type that in Craft by the Rose, or somebody can just Priscilla uh, got it. Priscilla, you had a crack. Love you. Up your brain. <laughs> Help me, girl. Free. Free. Don't go making her crazy, y'all. <laughs> oh, man. Please uh, drop it in for her. That'll be so. But it's called, Jardine, it's craft by the rose um uh, t-h-e-e -E. yeah t-h-e-e -E. d rose yeah there's her link right there if you want to become part of her family oh thank you um, Christina. rose maria she said hi folks chatty from trinidad i got a trinidad in here how are you today and welcome 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 now the project that i got that i that I got to do that y'all guess what now this don't seem I know it ain't gonna seem hard to y'all but me mm, yeah I uh uh I'll be catching it with some project What's like that? okay this what I got to do y'all this right here because I got a project that I gotta do I got a wall hanging that I gotta make okay and because it's it's on white material and i tried it before y'all remember one of my projects i had did 
I am great. I am great. I'm home from work. Love you, DOY. Thank you so much. I so, appreciate that. Go ahead. Thank so you. So I, mm -hmm. go ahead, baby. I gotta wash this. All of this. I gotta wash it before I can work with it. What? Does that make it work better? Like it make it more stiffer? Nope. It makes the where I get to die out of it before it starts messing up. Oh, I got you. That extra dye, it's got extra dye. Thank you, Ursula, for crocheting and listening. I appreciate you, my friend. Yeah. Oh, you get you rinse the dye out. Yeah, you got to. Else, else when I start that project, when I start that project, it's gonna be so saturated. And even though I keep my hands clean, the dye will be so saturated that it'll make my project dirty. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I got you. I got you. Mm. I mean, that makes sense, Tina. And that comes from experience, right? Comes from doing it and messing up. Right. <laughs> yeah. 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 So I gotta wash all of this. I and that's why that project ain't started. Mm -hmm. But it's gonna I gotta do it soon. But yeah, that's that that project. That project. I wash all of that three. Mm -mm. That's okay, Tina. Hey, you gotta do what you gotta do if you wanna make sure it doesn't bleed. Okay. Yeah, okay. that's that sounds good. Uh, Distinctive Crochet say this channel has a lot of good tips and that is Mindful Crafts and more. If you guys are not part of her family, please uh, join her family. Join whatever links that you guys yeah. are seeing being dropped. And if you need your link dropped, just put CC and one of the beautiful, awesome moderators will drop your link. Um, Mama G says, Sweet Tina is a wealth of knowledge. Thank yeah. you so much. Oh, y'all. Oh, I love y'all so much. <laughs> no, Tina, don't stop. <laughs> Tina, don't, don't, sing. Tina, don't sing about it. Please, don't. Oh, my God. Oh, no, I can't sing, girl. Don't tell me. I can't sing. I already know I can't sing. But I love, I love to do it anyway. Okay. I know that's right. Me, too. Yeah, we can help ourselves. Me too. Yeah. Me too. So uh thank you guys for just putting the CC there. And one of the moderators, please drop those CC links, y'all. See being posted, please. Thank you guys so much for your love and for your help. I appreciate that. As the words of Azra, you all are the real MVPs. <laughs> okay, thank it's you. Azra, she, she, she hasn't uh, been on. I haven't seen her in a while. But she, I think she serves in the military, but she'd be tripping out when she'd be like, you all are the real MVPs. Okay. <laughs> yes, Tina, when you get your studio, honey, you're going to be legit. Too legit. Too legit to quit. Ow! Too legit. Too legit to quit. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> Yes, Tina. You're gonna be MC Hammer too legit to quit, honey. Baby, because yes. all kinds of stuff gonna go on in that studio. She said that yes. studio gonna be a, a work of art, y'all. Everywhere I look, I'm just and you know, I'm gonna I'm a, I can't I ain't gonna have no money, so I'm gonna have to do everything very cheaply. Hey. So we're gonna we're gonna start off with the cheap, 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 the low, 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 and then we're going to work our way up to whatever we want. Oh, whatever we want. Crack, uh, uh, Katrina said, Miss Tina, yes, Tina has lots of experience and tip. Thank you, Priscilla, for dropping Mama G gear uh, channel. If you guys not part of her family, please do. Uh, Monda say, I am back. Monda, you love us. You love us. No, just kidding. Thank you. Ursula said, uh, my husband is tone deaf, so if he sings, I run away or I chase him away. <laughs> Either or, he out of there, huh? Thank you, Priscilla, for dropping Crafty Crochet Bible with Angela. If you guys are not 
part of Angela channel, go ahead and join. Thank you guys so much. Yes. Yeah, Monda. Monda and left the building. She said, here I am. I know, Monda. I'm usually, I'm usually up and out, but you said laugh out loud. Y'all have me dancing over here. You know, we be trying, girl. We be trying. I be trying. <laughs> Tina is focused on her doll, and I am focused on my ski mask. We gonna we having a contest who can get done the fastest. Oh, uh, I'm I'm lost. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 no, uh, uh, I know I ain't gonna get. I ain't, ain't gonna gonna racing, y'all. We gonna see. She gonna make that doll before I get off, and I'm gonna finish this <laughs> before you know. Uh, you will be gone, left me in the dark a thousand times over where I'm at. <laughs> I ain't even, I ain't nowhere near where I need to be Woo. at. <sighs> Don't chicken out now, Tina. Uh-uh, 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 uh-uh. <laughs> nope, mm -mm. nope, I can't do it. I, I'm, I'm so far left in the dark. <laughs> I'm going to tell you that now. Girl, listen. Mm -mm. I'm, I'm so left it's, in the dark, way back there. This I, I might as well start it off at the end of the line. <laughs> listen, this race is not given to the swift, okay? All right. It's okay. I'm just teasing. I know that's right, girl. I am just teasing, but I know I'm not. I'm not, you know, Tina, I'm working on this one here, but... I'm working it on it the way that I'm working it because I'm here with you all. However, mm -hmm. I, um, you know, I might just put this down, you know, for a minute or two. I just work it how I can. And after that, I just park it for a second, give my hands a break. Uh, Distinctive Crochet, thank you so much for dropping Lily Crochet and more link. Thank you. If you guys are not part of her channel, please join. Um, I have to, you know, I don't try to work so, you know, panically trying to get it done because it really takes the fun out of it. Okay. You know, like a crochet Olympic to me. <laughs> ah, yes. It takes the fun out of it. When you be like, oh, I got to hurry and get it done. It really takes the joy out of it. You be like, you know what? That's okay. I'm I'm just gonna park this and and never and never drive it again. <laughs> oh wow! So yeah. Yeah, boy. So like I said, with this here, with this ski mask, um, I'm winging it myself, but I'm starting this off. If you guys are interested, I'm starting this off as a basic beanie. And mine is going to, I'm going to have it come all the way down here to like my eyebrows. And then I'm just going to make it for my eyes, you know, just have an opening for my eyes. And then I'm just going to bring the rest of it down. So just looking at a lot of you guys do it. Um, I'm like, okay, I mean, that's it. I got that. I said, I got you. I got you. And that's how, and that's how I'm going to do it. I mean, um, Priscilla say, check out these recently recent makes from Gotcha Hook. Thank you, Priscilla, for dropping Gotcha Hook. That's the beautiful Vicky Link. Join her family. Jeanette, I had to get something to eat. Uh, my data is not working like it should. I, listen, hey, hey, don't be out there, you know, not eating. <coughs> if you got to eat, eat. If you got to eat, grab you something. That's why I always say grab something. I just don't, I try to eat, I try to grab a little bit something before I actually come on camera because not all, not everybody want to see me eat. <laughs> some of you guys don't mind if I do, but some people do. So I figured eat before I get on and I'll be okay. But if I was hungry, I will just exit to the left and grab me something to eat. Oh, that's right. Exit right on to the left and be like, okay, I got to get this food in. Get her in and get her done. Like like, uh, like Tina, getting her done. 
awesome, Jeanette. And things went. Thank you, Priscilla. Yes, you got this, Jeanette. Your description is on point. Thank you, Katrina. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. So anyway, that's what I'm doing, guys. I'm gonna finish this up whenever I finish it. I, I don't have a time limit. Either get done. It's not like anyone is waiting for it. See, I like how you did the feats of those too. You didn't do oh. the, the standard um, round mean, bottom feet. Uh -uh. Round bottom. Your your yours look like is 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 these boots was made for walking. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Y'all know what I start. I thought of something that I might could do to make toenails on them. I thought of something that I might. So when they take their shoes off, yeah, that they can see uh toenails. Ah, wow. Yeah, but I might do it because I do have the the, the space where I could do it. Wouldn't that be just awesome, y'all? It sounds like you got a lot of ideas running through your head. It's so yeah. many things you want to do, don't it, Tina? I just love, uh, you know, I love my babies. They my babies. And so, yeah, I uh, definitely, I, I let my creative juices run wild with me. For my babies, yeah. Yeah. Because my grandmother's was, my grandma, I had, the best grandmother in the world. My mother wouldn't even let me have the pets that my grandmother had for me. Okay. My grandmother had all my pets at her house. Oh, she yeah. Loved me. Okay. So, yeah. I, I think we, I got it. Yeah, we didn't, we didn't, um, we didn't have any pets either. So you say check out the whole set. Thank you, Priscilla. Yeah, I'm going to. I have been, um, you know, kind of like not posting as much, Priscilla, on Deal Wildlife. But I got to get back into the swing of things. I'm telling that vlog is took me and Lisa out of here. Lily crocheting more after we got through our vloggers. We was like, I don't know, guys. That is it, right? <laughs> I know that I didn't even do it because of that. I can't, I can't. It's hard. That's hard. That is really hard to do. Thank you, Vicky. Oh. Vicky, say have a blessed day, everyone. Got to get back to work. Thank you so much, Vicky, from Got Your Hook. Blessings to you. Yes, I'm telling you. Yep, yeah, it's it's more than an ocean, Miss Tina. It's oh no, I, I tried it already. I, I, you can't play with when you first said it. I said, "Uh, uh, nope, mm, mm, cause girl, I can't, I can't, I can't crack myself up." Priscilla said, "Priscilla said y'all was wearing me out." Yes, Priscilla, it's true, it's true. I mean, Priscilla. Okay. I was wearing myself out trying to do those. I mean, I was wearing myself out, Tina. Doing a video every day. It's a lot of work. It's a lot of work. You know, it's not like going, it's not going live. Live, you just turn it on your computer and you get to just talk. Doing a video, I got to record it. I got to upload it. I got to edit it. See, go, if I had to go live every day, I think that would be more easier than actually doing a recording and uploading the video. But Priscilla said, y'all was wearing me out. <laughs> Priscilla, that's my friend. I was wearing myself out. Mama say, have a great rest of the day. Got your hook. Yes. Girl, I was wearing myself out. Go ahead, okay. Tina. What's your uh, okay, so now I done finished the nose. Okay. And it'll get some more shaping when I uh when I get the thread to go in it. Okay. So it'll get more shaping. Then ah, come on. There you go. But you know, I see places where I could do a where the I'm gonna have to use the needle and thread to get it like I want it. Okay. Uh, and that I'm I'm used to because you with that thread when they can't see, they ain't gonna be able to see nothing. Mm -mm. <laughs> they 
gonna be able to tear this dial up. Nope, mm -mm, nope. That's, that that oh, would be the concern. Now I'm gonna feed the see. I'm feeding the strain back up around, back and through here, back down around somewhere. Okay. They ain't gonna be able to find where the end is at. That's for sure. Lily, I'm Cro sure. Lily Crochet and Moore said, "I know, right, Janelle? I am today getting back to people's channel." I mean, Lily, I was like, I just can't. I had to. I had to narrow it down to like which channel I'm gonna watch. Am I gonna watch DOY Creations subscribers or over here? And I was like, I had to just like pump my brakes and really just get it together. So I feel good now that it's done, it's over. I took a week of just trying to recap. The only video that I uploaded was my bell peppers. And so that was to me sufficient enough. And I'm good with that. I'm happy, I'm happy. I'm happy. That's somebody tired when you when you got to say happy that many times. That means you're really tired. <laughs> when you start repeating yourself too many times, that means you wore out. You been wore out. <laughs> mm -mm. But see, I knew that it was like that, so that's why I was like, enjoy. I watched all of them too. I tried to watch every one I seen. But I made them That's short though. I, I didn't make any one thing about it though. You can say about me, I didn't, I wasn't long with them. My video was two or three minutes long. Yeah. The longest was 10 minutes. I didn't, it's one thing if I got to watch you every day, I can't watch an hour video every single day. So I had to like make them like two, three minutes. You know, I try to get them as short as I possibly could. So yeah. Um, yeah. Michael Craft said, we saw the dedication to complete the challenge and your channels. I think we all celebrated when the month ended. Absolutely celebrated for your achievement. Absolutely. Thank you for dropping Priscilla from Distinctive Crochet's channel. Mama G said, thank you for joining her channel. And see, like I said, when I'm working, my hands let me know when it's time for me. You okay? Um, my hands let me know when it's time for me to put my work down. I don't try to force it. So right now, this is as far as I got with my um, my ski mask, which is just going to be a hat. It's going to be, you know how you're just making a basic beanie? This is Red Heart, guys. If you want to know in Burberry, a Mulberry, one of those colors. I give you guys all the specs at a later date but this is just making the crown of it so i'm just going to make the hat and then once i'm done i'll pick it back up but i'm not forcing myself to finish around because it makes my hand hurts i'm telling you uh lily said you are welcome beautiful you're learning how to do this yes hi yvette yvette say hi Jeanette and tina yvette how yvette, are you today yvette. hey yvette how you doing <laughs> Lily, hey girlfriend, how you doing, Lily? Hey, Mama G. Hey, 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 everybody. I'm sorry that I'm just paying attention to the dial right now, though. And that's okay. Yeah. I want you. You're the guest, so you can definitely, um, you can definitely, you know, be flexible. Oh. I need to be flexible, babe. Yes, indeed. Lily said, I know, right? My longest video was like six minutes, Jeanette. Yeah, I was trying to do, I was like, it's one thing that I'm doing them every day. It's another thing of uh, the length of time I'm going to do it. So I'm going to do about, you know, two, three minutes, five minutes. I'm not going over 10 minutes because once I go over 10 minutes, nobody's going to be interested. Because you know what? You can go to your analytics and see the time span that folks watch your videos. So you might as well stay in that ballpark when you doing a video every day. Not if you just doing a regular video, try to get those as long as you can, but a video every day, no ma'am, doing pretty good. Last day of vacation and crocheting on a wrap, almost finished with the shawl in the ball. Awesome event. Manda said, I love y'all, but my husband just made it home from work. Have a great rest of your day, y'all. You as well. Thank you, Manda. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to um, 
you know, get on here, like I said, about two or three minutes into the video, if anybody watched the replay, two or three minutes into the video, my internet had went down. So I was just trying to make up for the time that, that time gap that I lost. But uh, Priscilla, thank you. So, I mean, uh, not Pris Priscilla, yes, thank you. But Tina, I'm getting ready to head on out of here. Oh, okay. Thank you so much for hanging out with me and staying up here. No, that's no that's my no challenge. Problem. Look, I'll be when I leave your house, I'm going to somebody else's house. Okay. I'm trying to do the best I can, you know, to do what I gotta do. Okay. Out. I don't, I mean, I'm totally retired. This is what I do all day, yes. every day. Yes, yes. And I love all of y'all. Thank you, Angela Young. Thank you all. To see you in my house again. Everybody, come on over. Everybody, uh, if you uh, leave a comment, I will co go to your channel. If you join my channel and I see Stella. that you have joined, I will join your channel back. But if I can't see it, I don't do it because, hey. Can't see it. You might be the enjoying, but I, if I don't know it, I can't do nothing about it. By yeah. the grace of God, yes. I'm yeah. Here. So thank you so much, Tina. Thank you, everyone. Everyone have a great rest of your day. Drink your water. <laughs> say your prayers. And I love you guys. And I'll see you guys later. Deuces. Thanks again, Tina. You Bye, guys. Don't forget Bye -bye. to thumbs up. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Bye.